The Guru Learning Navigator first and foremost allows the teacher to understand where their students are. This class of nine students happens to have two in Unit 1, seven in Unit 3. That type of distribution can give a rough understanding of where people are and help teachers manage their classes and support them. They can see also down to specific lessons where the students are and where the students themselves individually by their icons happen to reside within a lesson. Student location working through the curriculum alone helps inform planning and management. Moving over to the data tab, when planning and not facilitating, it's easiest to look across units and drill down to see how students are doing. The results here are calculated only based on what students attempt. Untried assessments do not go in as zeros. It's important to understand that an 80% needs the context of completion. When planning, it's important to know that, for example, someone who has an 80% but has only done one out of the 50 assessments in the unit needs to understand that they're a little bit far from being finished. Teachers go through the data tab during their planning to try and identify the different students for different components of class. Looking back at the various planning components, there could be a topic that the entire class with respect to an academic topic may need to look at again for the common launch. Or it could be just trying to identify power pairs. Power pairs, for example, if I notice someone is struggling particularly with a lesson and has worked through already quite a few of the assessments and someone else has been quite successful, I may drill down and identify who those students are and match them. Perhaps Taylor Swift needs to support Lady Gaga or Steph Curry with respect to this lesson. I can drill down further and create a couple of those pairs, noticing, for example, that Taylor Swift has done quite well on prime and composite numbers, where Lady Gaga may need a little help. Taylor Swift may work for three to four minutes with Lady Gaga and Steph Curry, while I may identify another person who may work with one or two others. This is an efficient way to support people while the teacher does individual check-ins and group lessons.